Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Solitary Skies. It's the Agrarian Skies mod. Uh, still, um, last time, uh, after the recording session, I did something. I did something. Look at this. Look at this. I changed it all up. Uh, well, I didn't change it all up, but I kind of made it more space efficient. I put it all. I put the the, the smelter. What? What the high oven? I put right in the in the corner there, and the smelter. I put right beside it, and then I put the the the, the tool forge to the right, then and, and the casting basin and the casting table, and right there are all the all the the casts, and the, the thingy magic where the, uh, what's it called? What's it called? Uh, the the crucible uh, that gives me more uh, lava is right there. Uh, which is good since I can uh, because I can scoop it up and put it right into uh, the smeltery which is kind of the reason I put it there in the first place also I made a little bit of a fence here on the on the on the outside right around here expanded the platform a little bit out this is gonna be uh, in the end I'm gonna have to make a little shed with with the smeltery and, and the high oven in there and possibly the deep tank or whatever else we're gonna do uh, then uh, you already had a little bit of a look. Ah, uh, yeah, right. So that might be irritating to you. There is no more cobblestone generator and uh, crusher and t terrain smasher and whatever else that gives us all the nice ores. But I did something else. I built a lower level, which is right down here, and we're gonna visit this now. It is accessible right now only through the bedroom you go down here it also it doesn't look like very much right now so first of all uh, the background goes dark and black which is very eh, I don't know it's a bit it's a bit scary actually Wh which I guess is good but never mind it it, it adds to the, to the sense of danger you know where you're up in space well you're up in the sky of some thing. So actually when you look at it like this it looks like you're on the horizon of a huge black hole no no it doesn't make sense in any way shape or form if that was like say yellow or orange you could imagine being in the orbit of Jupiter but since it's just black it, it doesn't feel like you're in orbit of any kind of planet and also t since you're obviously having an atmosphere here and what yeah, I'm just rambling on anyway I built th the whole generator of awesomeness down here more, be a little more space efficient. Look at it's the uh, uh, it's crushing it right there. Whoop, going into this. Oh, I upgraded it right now into this um, iron chest. It gets sucked out. Get put into the autonomous activator. The other one, uh, the, this one places down. The other one crushes it with. I put a shit ton of um, iron hammers in there, so that should hold. Should hold out for a time. They're already uh, in some use since it took me some time to build this whole thing. Um, getting sucked out uh, by the, uh, what's it called, the vacuum hopper, back into the chest, sucked out, blah 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 blah, into this autonomous activator where it gets, uh, where the gravel gets sieved uh, and put into this chest. Right now, oh, we already earned two emeralds and a diamond and a few other things in the time this whole thing has been running. And also this is going to be a room, so I already started here. Uh, this may be a giant window of some sorts. Uh, it might not be. We'll see. I haven't uh, put uh, a. I haven't actually extended uh, the the wall out here because I might be extending the room out here. I don't know because I found out. Actually, I didn't find out. Oh, we're starving. Okay, let's eat a few carrots. I didn't find out, uh, or I kind of sort of did find out that macerators and uh, pulverizers both do the job of crushing down cobblestone into sand. Now, if I'm correct, sand, okay, that was the wrong one, uh, sand, actually, you know what, sieve, right? It's a sieve? Yes, it's a sieve. Uh, the sieve with R, no, it's R, it's E, no, it's not E, um, yeah, right click, okay, no, yes, right click. That's the fuel. Okay, see, if we put in uh, gravel, we get uh, emeralds, diamonds, uh, lapis lazuli, appetite, amber, quicksilver. I always get an appetite f for some uh, appetite. I always get hungry when I when I read the appetite thing. Uh, whatever else that actually means. Coal and a lot of broken ore and flint. 
If we crash down sand, oh crap. Okay, when we crash down sand, we don't actually get any diamonds or emeralds or any of the other good stuff. That's not good. We get Ceratus Quartz. Okay, so I think we're gonna have to do three steps here. Ah. <sighs> I wanted to avoid this. It's apparently not possible. Uh, well, anyway, oh, no matter. Then we have to have three machines. The whole this whole setup three times. Uh, three times? Really? No. Uh, one time we're gonna do this whole uh, cobblestone generator, putting it in there, getting pu pulverized or macerated, whatever, to sand and then sift the sand. And another time we're gonna do the whole this whole thing again, but putting a pulverizer or a macerate in front of it, uh, making it into sand, and then uh, this thing will actually crush the sand into dust and sift the dust. So we'll have one machine that saves uh, gravel, one machine that saves dust, and uh, one machine that saves um, sand, gravel, dust. Okay, one for gravel, one for sand, one for dust. Uh, the the sand one will be the smallest because it doesn't need uh, the whole upper step, the whole crushing step. Also, that means we're gonna have to very oftenly replace those hammers. I'm thinking we need to get a lot of diamonds to just put diamond hammers in there, so they hold a lot longer than hammers I have right now. Uh, also, th it goes faster. Which brings me to the point of this being actually filled up with gravel. And it might be a good idea to just do this whole thing a second time. Like literally just build another autonomous activator, plunk it down right here, build another sieve, plunk it down right there, and have uh, a second um, pipe going to the other autonomous activator, f also filling up with gravel. And we don't actually need a second vacuum hopper because I'm sure that one can suck from here as well, putting it into the chest, making it uh, doubly as fast, possibly. Is it? Is it going to be? Because look at this, when it, when it has this sign, then it's already, what, what, um, you know, filled up. No, it is, it has, what, what's the word? Damn it! It is full. The pipe itself is full of stuff and can't transport anymore. Whatever else that word is called, I can't remember just now. Uh, which I'm gonna do next episode. Uh, wow, oh, sorry, I'm already, I'm talking this already seven minutes in. Jeez, we haven't done anything. Really sorry, so this is all happening. Uh, I'm definitely gonna see. Uh, the, th the only thing I'm, uh, I'm having to think about is the pulverizer is gonna powered by what exactly? Pulverizer. The pulverizer, pulverizer, pulverizer. Where is it? Um, there it is. It's thermal expansion. Building it is fairly easy, but powering it. Oh yeah, the macerator. Macerator. Is there no macerator? Doesn't look like there's a macerator. Okay, so we have to do the pulverizer. Fine. We have to power it with thermal expansion, which means. I'm gonna take care of that off camera. Maybe some dynamo compression dynamo array, I don't know. But we'll see. We'll see. It's gonna work out. I'm gonna have the machine more or less ready the next time. Unless there is an uh, there's probably actually a quest to, to make a pulverizer. We'll see that. Oh yeah. Uh this time we wanted to do and we're actually going to do Hell's Kitchen uh the cheese. Spice it up. We are get the fresh milk and the fresh water. Now we need salt, cheese, uh, butter and heavy cream. Now if I remember correctly, then oops, then heavy cream is the first one, and you need just uh, some water and and uh, something else with it. Uh, have a quick look. Heavy cream. It's made with milk and a mixing bowl. Yes, just whipping milk. Just whipping milk. Oh yeah, that's another thing I did. I can't go. Uh, I put the chest right next to the crafting station, which means I can do this right now. Milk bottle into the mixer, getting a heavy cream. Then uh, doing the heavy cream with something else and something else. Oh, also, I actually do need a bit of water. I think, maybe, I probably do. We'll see. Anyway, uh, where is it? The next, the next thing is butter, right? 
I always put that on there. Butter. Oops. No, nope. with to you. Butter. Uh, salt. Uh, saucepan and heavy cream. Salt, saucepan, and heavy cream. Now a pot and water gets me salt. And a salt, a frying, oops, a frying pan and heavy cream. Hmm. Salt, heavy cream, and a, a saucepan. I don't have a saucepan. Why don't I have a saucepan? That is weird. Okay. A saucepan is made by an iron and then stick. Why don't I have a saucepan? Anyway, we do have iron. I th I think we do have iron. Look at look it up. Choo -choo -choo -choo. Yeah, when I ink it right there. Why don't we have a saucepan? Wasn't there a quest to make a saucepan? Have I lost the saucepan? I probably lost the saucepan. Um, okay. Get this out and the stick in. And there's our saucepan and the salt and heavy cream and we made butter. Now we what is that actually? That looks nice. Cranberry sauce. Nah, that's an unfulfilling smack. Smack? An unfulfilling smack. <laughs> no, it's a snack. Um so what else? We have oh no the cheese. Okay, the cheese. Cheese. It's made by salt milk and a pot. Salt milk and a pot. Sounds fairly easy. A pot. Uh, Snap-a-doodle-doo. I don't actually have water again. Maybe I should put an infinite water source over there, or I'll just move the whole cooking stuff over here and make a kitchen. Which pans out, since there's the frying pan that I'm going to move anyway. And I can just expand here, because I've forgotten what I want to build here anyway. And unless somebody reminds me in the comments, it's not actually going to happen. I think it was, uh, sorry, um, I think it was cream, cream pastures were just more place and space for our nice little farm. But on the other hand, it might as well be just, uh, I might as well just build it out there. So no, this is not going to be a problem whatsoever at all. So first of all, a bit salt again. A little bit of salt. We get eight fresh buckets. We want to, hmm. How do I do fresh milk again? Come on. I forgot how I do fresh milk. Did just... No. It's something with a glass bottle. I'm sure it's something with a glass bottle. Okay, well, looking it up right now before I take ages to do it. Fresh milk. Already got fresh milk. Well, how... Wait, how do I bottle it then? Milk. A bottle of milk. How do I get a bottle of milk? And why does it have a texture here and not here? A milk bucket and a glass. Okay, not fresh milk. I can't actually do anything with fresh milk. Except use it. Well, I'm fine. Okay. Okay. We'll just use the fresh milk. We get eight bottles anyway. The fresh milk. The... Why did I do butter when I don't actually need it for the... Well, never mind. Okay, fresh milk butter. Jeez. Nourishing morsel. That's a nourishing morsel. I need... Oh, I'm thinking about doing that again, because I don't <laughs> like living on carrots, and wow, that didn't actually do much for my hunger, did it? F did it fill up one and a half, or just a half? Because then I'm just going to stick with the carrots, even though I'm technically allergic to raw carrots. So, there's that, but what the hell? Let's put the butter in here, fresh milk, mixing bowl, um... And go harvest our stuff here back up. Since I actually am quite hungry. Hmm. Was it always that the carrots didn't stick? Oh yeah, I needed to replant them. Nah, crap. And then tab a hoe. Where did I got my hoe? Did I put it in here? Have I ever had a hoe? Yeah, I must have had a hoe. Otherwise that wouldn't have worked. Oh, 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 Nobody's telling me where it is, right? Oh, there. Oh, there I put in pickaxes, sure. Oh, it's still, it's mining level diamonds. I, don't, I forgot that. We haven't actually mined that much with it, so we're still clumsy with it. No, I don't have a hoe. That is annoying. That is very much annoying. Okay. Oh. 
I guess just a wooden hole will do. A wooden hole will do. We're not trying to do any kind of wanderers right now. We are not farming just yet. That's another thing I'm thinking of doing before the next uh, recording sesh is... I say session. It's I, I'm trying to do it one at a time, one episode at a time, so that if, when, you know, maybe a comment decides to flatter in, I can actually take that into consideration. Hmm, cherry. <laughs> that gives me half a hunger too. That's nice. Um, yeah, I'm thinking whatever the cow is doing here, I don't know. How could I, if it could I just spawned there. It's an absolute uh, wonder to me. Yes, yes, and... I wanted to have a dirt floor for the orchard, for the orchard, yeah, for the orchard, for the garden with all the trees. So this is going to be a lot of work, involving a lot of shearing and putting it in here and just uh, gathering up a lot of dirt, which I'm not going to make you watch. Uh, what was it? What was I doing? Oh yeah, planting uh, the carrots. I'm not going to make you watch that. Oh, I could actually get myself a bit of bread again. Hmm. I'm sure bread is more nourishing than those damned um, carrots. So, sugar cane. I got sugar cane. I should try to make a few things. I'm going to try to ha ha have a little bit more variety in my diet. We're gonna, But first, I'm going to go for the bread. For the whole bread thing, uh, <sighs> my crafting tables are all over the place. But just not where I need them. 13 pieces of bread. How much does it give me? Well, one and a half. That's a lot better. Okay, I'm doing this. This is cool. So we finished the spice it up quest. And we can... Ooh, cherry jam sandwich. And in a life, I've got eight remaining now. I'm certainly going for the cherry jam. Nourishing meal. Nourishing light meal. Okay, I'm going to go for the lunch. Actually... Let's put them both in here, just to be sure. Next thing on the list, what did we say? Did we say anything? Look, this is smooth ice. What? Smooth ice cream. Oh, ice cream can be made by mixing snow and juice. I don't actually have snow. The easiest way to get snow and ice for recipes and crafting is by making glacial extruder. Oh, the glacial precipitator. And providing it with power and water. Ah, that will show me what I can actually do to power the thing. A task where the player needs specific items to... Because I have the Steam Dynamo, but it uses water, which I can get fairly easy, and coal, which I don't have a lot of. So I don't see that working too much out for us. A task where the player needs specific items... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, trying to do a smooth ice. I'm gonna... I guess we can do that soon enough. Steel-powered flight. I always keep coming back to this one. Um, uh, yeah, it needs, it's complete steel armor, which I would like, and the deep tank, which also would like, but, eh, you know. Seasom is also a source of power, it can be fed to dynamos. I'm actually, maybe I'm gonna make a steam, uh, maybe i make a steam turbine. Okay, uh, we'll just look at those things, but your visit, Steve, is also something we wanted to look into. Learning to skyblock, uh, is there anything? Uh, I'm, I'm trying to see if there's a oh, power processing. Yeah! See, there's a quest for a pulverizer, so we're gonna do that. Let's build a pulverizer. Jeez, come on. Oh, and a diamond hammer as a result for that. And a uh, bag. So, pulverizer shouldn't be so hard to pull off since we all got this, uh, got all this stuff now. Pulverizer. Here, it needs me two flint, two copper, a uh, redstone transmission coil. Nope. A reception coil. Machine frame. A machine frame is just four iron ingots, uh, glass, and a golden ingot. I think I need to smelt up some of that stuff. We'll see what I have. I've got three iron ingots. I've got no gold ingots. Invar aluminium I don't need. Uh, just looking forward. I also need some copper. <laughs> Something else? Something else? Something else? It doesn't look like I need something else. Oh yeah, iron. More iron. Okay, so... Let's make those into iron blocks. Or iron ore gravel. Uh, iron, iron ore gravel. <laughs> I can't talk again. 
I think I never could, but you know. Whatever! Oh, I do actually have a bit of coal. Yeah, but I don't want to waste it on this. It seems like it's gonna go away very quickly if I use it to power stuff. More sugar cane! So, putting this into. Where is it? Where is it? Pulverizer. Oh, yeah. Into here. I'm gonna put two iron ores, or three iron ores, and two copper. Three copper. Two gold. I don't think any of that stuff mixes. No. Gold mixes with aluminium to do aluminium brass, I think. Copper doesn't mix with iron, does it? I, c I can't think of anything, any reason why it should mix with iron. A f oh, a fluid duct. That's a fluid duct. That I'd be like, ah, that's what I need if I want to transport the water. Of course. Right. So I have a few letters left. Moss stones, because there were moss stones here. However they came to be, I think it was something to do with the barrels standing over there. The water just leaking through. Making cobblestone into moss stone. Ooh. I remember now. I remember now. Oh, we're gonna try this. I hope it works. Jeez. Um. I think we need four pieces of moss. Oh, jeez. Maybe I actually. Maybe we do need a bit more than four. I think we need nine. Yeah. Uh, we need nine pieces of moss stone to get a moss ball. Which makes a tool self-repairing. But we don't have it. We don't have S uh S <laughs> eight cobblestone moss thingies. We can get five. Five's not nine, so I'm not gonna bother with that. I'm gonna look at some uh, some maybe have some barrels standing out there with water all the time. Oh, well I can try that. We can try that. It's, it doesn't take much to build a barrel. So just an oak wood slab and what what Yeah. Let's get a few barrels out. I have enough wood. I'm sure there was a fast way of doing it, but I'm just gonna do it like this. Whoop! Eight oak barrels. No, six oak barrels. I can't even count anymore. Potato, potato, tomato. Yeah, put it on there. Whoop. Whoop. I'm gonna change how they're standing later on. But just for now, just trying to get some mossy uh, cobblestone. Another five. So then we can actually get ourselves uh, a moss ball for our pickaxe. Oh, do we want to enchant our pickaxe or do we want to enchant something else? Eh, nah, we'll see. Yes, that's good. Look at this. That's what we want to have. And we're gonna need the ingot cast. Put it in here. First, pour an iron ingot out. Oh, yeah. Oh, gold. And a gold ingot. We need a gold ingot. Pouring it out. No, 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 no. Ah. Ah. I didn't want to do that. Well, I guess we're going to get ourselves an iron block. So, what else? Why did I go into this? Oh, yeah, here. There, there's the glass. One, two, three, four. And we need copper. And the red trans. The red trans. Come on. Coil. A coil. Some kind of coil. A reception coil. Which is gold and two redstone. I don't have much redstone left. I'm gonna steal it from here again. Redstone reception coil. Uh, we got enough gold to get ourselves a fully formed cube. Come on, fill it up. And then we need two copper ingots. Whoop! Thank you very much. Break it down into ingots. Then get a second one. Come on. Oh, why don't I have a crafting table around here? That's a miss. Gonna have to go over here to do our stuff. Whoops, not the chest. One, one, two, three, four. 
the four iron ingots right there made it polarizer polarizer flint copper the transmission coil and the piston oh yeah a piston uh, yeah need another iron ingot pour it out I know it's it, this episode is gonna be a little bit longer but I took so long to explain what's going on downstairs sorry sorry absolutely sorry for that there's the coil um, flint and this one is ah oh, Jesus okay I am such a dumbass please give me another redstone thank you very much put it in here just I uh, think that was wrong I'm pretty sure that was wrong cobblestone on the sides no no piston wait that is right what the hell oh of course the one thing that could still be wrong I did wrong and the last one is two pieces of flint one two thank you back to the crafting table now put in the transmission coil no the reception coil the two copper ingots the flint to the left and the right uh, yip -up 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 -up, the machine frame and last but not least the piston and we got ourselves a pulverizer we got ourselves a pulverizer quest done um, claim reward we take the middle reward back thank you very much this is a diamond with fortune with fortune that's awesome I'm thinking about keeping that for myself then we're just gonna open the reward back